You! Yes, you! What do you got? Guerilla. Got word from a deserter about a new checkpoint. Show them they can control us. Thanks. a lot of risks for one lieutenant. Want to complain? You can swim. Nice boat. Is it yours? No, I stole it. Papa taught me how to hotwire tractors when I was a kid. Boats aren't so different. Hey, we have to get Carlos a doctor. Hmm. Good luck. He's coughing blood. He needs help. Papa took me fishing once, south of Costa del Mar. He's a hell of a rancher, but a shit fisherman. No patience. Couldn't cast. Kept snagging his line on the bottom. Even hooked himself in the lip. <laughs> Got so pissed, he threw a stick of dynamite in the water. Killed a lot of fish, but also put a fucking hole in our boat. We swam five kilometers back to shore. All these boats stopped to help, but Papa told them to fuck off. What does this have to do with Carlos being sick? I'm saying that the day Carlos Montero gets help, it's the day hell freezes over, Danny. Coño, you Monteros are stubborn. Not me, just Papa. <laughs> sure, sure. Shut up. Fucking tobacco. 
They were supposed to make our people rich. That's what Anton said anyway. See, that's how he got elected. Yes, and a lot of us voted for him. We believed in his promises. We thought it was going to be like the old days again, like some kind of fantasy. We were so fucking wrong. If we want to change things, someone has to whip us all into shape, bring us together. And it's not going to be Papa. So Carlos doesn't have a plan. His plan is don't tell anybody what the fuck you're feeling ever. Don't trust anybody either, especially your own daughter. Just fucking react to whatever Napoleon El Pequeño throws your way. He's old school. Reminds me of my headmaster in the orphanage. Strict, tough as shit. But if he liked you, he had your back for life. Hmm. That kind of thinking is gonna get us all killed. We can't keep reacting to Jose. It's not working. We need to try new things. Be agile. Stay one step ahead of that little hijo de puta until he's dead. I'm with you. Good answer, Danny. Mierda. Smoking Mexican. Tobacco out here has been vivido. Can't even smoke our own anymore. Come mierdas. Shit. ¿Qué pasó? Jose fucking Castillo. Anton's bitch of a nephew. Lo veo y no lo creo. What's he doing? He's, uh, he's... With the lieutenant we were looking for. It looks more like a scientist. I'm gonna stick Jose up. No, no. You might hit the lieutenant. Fuck. Hey, over there. I need to know where that scientist is going. Let's search this place for him. Let's go. Maybe his friend by the helipad can help. They've got a medic.
special forces. It says Jose has a villa on the north side of the island. No password, idiota. Let's see what we got here. El Pequeño has a fucking torture chamber filled with outcasts. It's under the lighthouse just south of here. Cojone. Can you let me in? Done. I'll stay and see what else I can find. 
Suerte, Danny. Got to look closer. I see what happened. Jose is a monster. I thought I would never see my children again. Jose is a psychopath. Espada. Jose was using this place as his own little torture chamber. He had outcasts in there, but I freed them. Enfermo mental. I shouldn't be surprised. Good work, Danny. I found where that scientist works. The Singao we saw earlier. His lab's in Refmira. Meet me there. Okay. Then how are you gonna tell me what's really going on? You'll know when I need you to know. Find it! Just found more bodies. Run the fuck out! We won't get him in Man, the pain guys. Oh no, what the fuck? Run off, go! Go! He's over there! Go! 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 Estoy seguro por ahora.
Oye, guerrilla. I got word that Jose's pissed about his poison. You fucked up his operation good. Maybe I was wrong about you. Maybe. So now I'm going to ask you for a favor. Our people are rotting in Jose's prisons. One of them, Miguel, is like a son to me. We'll need a prison truck to bust them out. Steal one, then meet me at the gas station near the prison. We drive in, grab our people, and leave before anyone gets smart. I'm trusting you with this tourist. Don't fuck it up. Don't take too long with that prison truck. Okay. 200 pesos. Fuck you, I said it. You can't go with that. And I can't either. 25. Hey, a magic horse. Go! <laughs> Tourist, Phil is going to send you a picture of the type of truck we need. You can't send it yourself? He... Uh, I... I worry if this piece of shit form will just do what I... In Candela, this guy. Whoa, now. Come on. Easy. Vamos. I told you. They are not going to fire you just for dropping your wallet in the Viviro. I'm not worried about my job. I'm worried about my life. You know what they do to workers who fuck things up? But oh, fuck. Let's go. Whoa. Easy now. Come on. Get out of here. Truck. Good. Come get me at the gas station.
station. On my way. Gonna tell me what your big secret plan is? Soon enough, Danny. Master of Disguise over here. Shut up and get in the back. Okay. First time going back to this place since I broke out. It used to be a school. I sent my kids there. How long were you inside? Eight months. Maybe more. 18 hour days in the fields getting whipped and breathing in poison fucks with the memory. Sounds like hell. See, si, but I had Miguel. We kept each other straight. Yeah, you said he was like a son to you. Toughest motherfucker I know. Raised him like he was my own. Taught him to box. He almost made Senor Yara before we got taken. How did you get out? Camila snuck in one night, sliced up three guards, took two bullets to her shoulder, grabbed a hostage and sprung me and Philly. Oh yeah. Sounds like his father. That's my girl, but she couldn't find Miguel. And by that time there was too much heat. So we left him behind with more of our people. Just hope there's something left of him. We're close, no more talk. Montero, what are you doing here? Where's Miguel? I don't know. The guards took him somewhere in the prison. Mierda, it's off. We walk. Go. I'll find Miguel. If you get caught, it's you against the fucking army. 
It's okay, Papa. I wear my big boy pants. Crazy motherfucker. Meet us at the gas station when you go to. Suerte. Hey, pinga. I don't even know what this guy looks like.
engineer. Gas station. I know it's hard, but you gotta trust me. Everything's gonna be okay now. Yeah, it's family. Fighting is happening. We love each other. But that love is not unconditional. It is the duty of family to be honest with each other, to be comfortable, to keep each other in mind. When family goes astray, it falls to all of us to correct the mistake. I'm right behind you. Carlos said he took you in. Thought you boxing, that kind of thing. <laughs> he did. Yeah. Take good care of her, mijito. Thanks a lot. You ask a lot of questions. Just him. Almost there now. There he is, Senor Yara. Come on, get in. Hell yeah, brother. I knew you'd come for me. Oh, I said it! You look like shit! 
I thought you motherfuckers were on rations. <laughs> Still a dig. Still dry. Good for you. I'll bring kiss. <laughs> Miguel. I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't come for you sooner. I tried. You know I'd never forget you. No bullshit, Carlos. We do what we do to survive, mi hermano. Enough talk. Give me that fucking guitar. <laughs> did good, tourists. When I first saw you, I wanted to gut you like a crocodile, but you're Montero now, Danny. Gracias. So, do I call you Papa now? Shut up and drink. Oye, Dani. want this guy so bad anyway. El Come Mierda checks all the tobacco leaves for the Vivido process. We fuck up the leaves, we fuck up the cancer drugs, we fuck up Napoleon e Pequeño's operation, make him look bad in front of old Uncle Anton. No heat. How you wanna do this? We kill soldiers until we find him. And then? And then we kill more soldiers. Simple. I like it. Engineer. Uh. 
of dying. Mierda! 
Mierda is right. You look like shit, hermanito. Hermanito? We've been hunting your brother this whole time. Who the hell are you? Why didn't you just tell me? Alejandro, come on. We're going home. Vete pa'l carajo. Ale. Suéltame. Cojones. ¿Qué es lo que te pasa? What the fuck, Ale? I'm not going anywhere. I told you before, and I am telling you now. I believe in Castillo. I believe in Viviro and Jose. He's seen the vision through. Napoleon el Pequeño is a slave driver. He's fucking loco. Says the person trying to kidnap me. You change your name. You change your uniform, but you are still a Montero. And Papa still got a machete up his ass. And you are running to the jungle like you did when you were five. Except now you kill people and you call yourself, what is it? The spike? The sword. Wow, clever. What? You are going to stab me now? Papa is sick. I don't care. Papa gave up on me a long time ago and you know it. Family's a bitch, no? That's what I hear. We should split up. Not a word about this to Papa. Glad I know the real story now. I was worried you wouldn't help if you knew my brother was military. He's a traitor. See, si. but he's still family. Come back to camp soon. We got more work to do. Oye, Danny. Feels like this camp will never be finished. Look who it is, Chorizo. It's a hero. So we're good friends now, see? No hard feelings. Almost blowing you up is the past. We got to look to the future. And I see a military truck in your future. With special ammo, 
special weapons and a special sauce. And Philly wants it real bad. I like to plan ahead. And I got big plans to bump up the Montero firepower, see? First step is that truck. They're loading it up at Ocaso Marina. Bring the truck back to me in one piece, Hiro. I got big plans, buddy. Suerte. Bring it back and we'll talk. The marina. Now, whatever happens, just don't bounce the sweet baby. <laughs> what? The truck, don't damage it. Drive like there's a big bouncy baby Philly in the back. Bouncing baby Philly. Got it. You're gonna make baby Philly cry. Just bring that truck back in one piece. Okay, hero? Right where Philly said they would be. If those animals got out, there would be real chaos. Okay. Careful, Danny.
Hola, Philly. One very stolen truck is on the way. Perfect. Okay, send it straight into my loading arms. But don't let nobody follow you. Hmm? We like a cut in the night. A smooth, sleek, sexy guy. Yeah. Eh, I'm more of a dog person. So is Chorizo. But he forgets sometimes. Gracias. De nada. Now to get this bad boy back to Philly. Cooler. The hero returns. Yeah, and the hero needs room. <laughs> Finga! What is happening here? Philly magic, babe. Yeah, but I almost died for packing foam. No, 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 no. White gold. Hard to get. Burns like a motherfucker. Everything gotta know a purpose, Hero. Even you. 